Let's start off in the private school ranks with the Parish Episcopal Panthers, who have won the last four TAPS Division I state championships. And guess what? They are favorites to go five in a row in 2023. The Panthers return starting quarterback Sawyer Anderson and running back Maddox Reed, which will ignite an already powerful offense. With Caleb Mitchell Irving returning on the defensive line, expect to see Parish Episcopal back in the title game. Plano Prestonwood and Nolan Catholic should make some noise as well. In SPC, Episcopal School of Dallas couldn't make it back-to-back -back state championship games, but they will reload for another run in 2023. As for the lower classifications in UIL, Gunter has put together quite the dynasty in 3A. They've been to three of the last four state title games, winning two of them, including last year's Division II state championship. They graduated some serious playmakers, but Walker Overman returns at quarterback, and the Tigers are getting used to playing 16 games a year. In 4A, no one will forget Anna's unbelievable season in 2022. It started with that miraculous hook and lateral win over Aubrey in week two, and continued to 13 straight wins, including two against rival Salina, before losing to eventual state champ China Spring. Jacob Emmers and Sean Steens are back as go-to receivers as the Coyotes try to finish the job. Look out for Salina, Aubrey, and Glenrose in 4A as well.